shop with me. We are checking out Big W. This is the first year that I have done the Big W holiday range. I usually do Target. I usually do uh, Kmart. And it was requested that I do Big W. And last year, Big W actually came through for me for something in particular that I needed. If we spot it today. Yeah, I can, I can see him over there. Talk about it when we come across it. Now, um, I will specify that I am here quite late in the season. I am filming this in, no, uh, in December. So if the shelves are looking a little bit bare, I'm going to say that's actually my fault. I should have come earlier, but I can see we've got some sales going on, which is not too bad. Now, I'm at the one in Paran. This is my closest one, so I come here. It's not the biggest store, but we're going to take a look. Let's start with the lights. We've got a whole bunch of Mirabella lights here. These just look like, you know, your standard. Oh, they're solar powered, so they're outdoor. All right, that's fantastic. Prices are pretty good. We've got... Um, some rope lights we've got the you know string lights we've got the, the hanging lights what else do we have these are the indoor or outdoor which is pretty handy dandy um we've got the net lights they're really pretty i like these along the fence we've got some stars as well and then we do have some nice big tubs i quite like this up here the solar powered uh letter letters to santa um light that's really cute uh, i'm not sure on the price of that one though unfortunately but it's cute i like it um we have some more stars i think we saw something similar these are indoor use uh string lights these ones down here were outdoor use we have these uh little starburst one. Oh, oh what is that i want that that's really cool it's a i haven't seen something like this before it's a firework silver wire light. That's really cool. I like it. Um, we've got some cool white multicolor that we saw. These are little packs, which is really handy. I don't think I don't think I've really seen any tiny tiny light packs like this at any of the retailers. Um, usually they're you know bigger packs, so that's really cool. They have the multicolor and then they have the warm. These guys are battery operated though, so just keep that in mind. It doesn't look like they have any cool ones, but if you're just looking for like a really small set, if you've got a tiny little tree or you wanted to decorate something small, that's an option. Um, what on earth? This is so cool. These are flashing LED footsteps, Santa footsteps. They're solar powered, they're for outside and we have a solar powered led hanging ball light which you can also obviously it's designed for outside their solar um we have a koala and a kangaroo not particularly festive but that's all right uh, down here we have north pole lights these are kind of cool we haven't seen this sort of stuff anywhere else which is nice and we do have a whole bunch of genio lights as well um, if you're not familiar, oh, look, I'm sure many of you are familiar with it. You can run it off an app, which is fantastic. These look pretty cool. Festoon lights, multicolored festoon lights. Um, we have some solar powered candy cane type lights down here. Although they're not, what are, what are they? They're flame torches. Uh huh. There we go. Um, we've also got some silver trees and candy cane lights. There we go. Up the top here, we do have um, inflatable kangaroo. They light up and there is a Santa down there as well who's coming out of a chimney. He's awesome. I love that. We've got some really cute little balls here. Let's have a look. Oh, and these are plastic too, so not going to break. And sequins, but still sparkly. We love that. Uh, pink lemonade, that's cute. These are kind of tie-dye-ish and they are plastic. Again, usually they would be glass. You've got these little gnome Santas. Uh, you've got these guys here, which are cute. There's a flamingo, a rainbow, and a unicorn. Are these? No, they're plastic again. I actually, I don't mind that. It's clever. Uh, little wooden lollipop got some cute there's a butterfly there's a little angel there is a nutcracker 
Um, what have we got here? Oh, the bells. And this must be where we got them last year. Yeah, so last year, um, well, this year, we were pulling out our Christmas decorations and I found some bells exactly like this, but they're red and white. And I was so excited by them and I couldn't remember where we got them. Um, but it must have been here. We would have bought them on sale after the Christmas season and I'm not mad to have them. Um, down here, we have a rain, be rain beer. Wow, yeah, I need a beer. Um, <laughs> it's a reindeer, uh, which you can stick on like a flat surface. That's also solar powered and they have the, um, like the star wands. Got some nutcrackers. Down here, we have a moon wreath. That's interesting, that's a bit different. Rather than a full uh, wreath, this one is in like a, a moon shape, which is a crescent moon. Uh, we have these little trees here. I suspect, I suspect they were maybe supposed to have stars on them. Maybe, maybe, <laughs> maybe. Uh, anyway, they're really tall and skinny. They're designed for a tabletop, which is not a bad idea. Uh, we've got some luxury tinsel. It's quite soft. It has this like almost like a metallic matte look, which I quite like. Um, what else? We've got some baubles here. We love a green bauble. Oh, I love this design. That is super pretty. Yeah, I like them. They're nice. Uh, they're only $2.50 a pack, which is pretty good. They do have it in silver as well. Uh, more little decorations. Do they have a H? This is always the question. This is always like the main thing that's on my mind whenever I see something like this. No, they don't have a H. We're crying, we're all crying. Um, these are very sweet, the little doors with the bells. These are also quite nice. We have lettered stars. <gasps> There's a H, but I don't want a star. Oh, we're all crying. I'm crying, maybe you're not crying. Um, excuse me, this is freaking adorable. It's a knitted Christmas jumper ornament. Oh my actual goodness, that's divine. Um, there's also like a starfish ornament. These are sort of filigree leaves and there is a bobble wreath. Okay, this is quite cute. Um, it's a Mickey Mouse inspired wreath. Very sweet, $35. Uh, they also have like Harry Potter themed ones. So they have Hogwarts baubles on them and a little Hedwig. That's really adorable. What's under here? I'm not sure what these are. Oh, okay. So they're little Disney ornaments. Very cute. There we go. There we go. Um, I will say it looks like it's been picked bare. My fault though. Uh, this I love. Just because it reminds me of Christmas bells and it, you know, makes a noise. But they also have a lot of Disney, um, well, not a lot of Disney, but we'll just say it's like Mickey Mouse, Minnie Mouse inspired, um, not inspired, they're actual, like they're actual Disney baubles. Um, they also have this little dog one, which super cute, love it. Harry Potter baubles for the tree, which is cute. They also have uh, these Disney ones. You might be able to see the designs a little bit better just here. Um, over here, we actually have some for the Simpsons, which is cute. I haven't seen anything like that. There is a little Mickey and Minnie Mouse advent calendar just there. It contains Christmas baubles. So that would be a really cute one to open like with a young child because it doesn't include chocolates or lollies or anything like that fantastic um we have some mickey and minnie mouse themed christmas crackers looking at the crap inside we always love the crap inside it, it is what it is um and i don't know why this is here for christmas but i'm dead for it it's an alice in wonderland um ma uh, no is it the uh it's the rabbit what's his name Oh, I can't remember. Anyway, it's a cake stand. I love it. 
There is also a molded cookie jar here with Mickey's face on it. Let's have a look at what we've got going on here. There is a ceramic treat bowl. It is Santa's pants. And back here we have more uh, Disney Mickey Mouse baubles. They're really into the Mickey Mouse, aren't they? Apparently, that is, that's what's going on. We do have a Harry Potter cookie jar, which is kind of cool. Someone's opened it up. I'm not going to pull it out because I just don't think I should. Um, did we see these before? No, we saw different ones, but these are again Harry Potter themed baubles. So hopefully you can get a little bit of an idea of some of the designs. Let's see if this one offers a bit more info. There we go. Cute. Um, we've got snow globes, we've got Shrek baubles. Uh, oh, this is pretty cute actually, the Hedwig mug. Um, what is this? This Oh, it's a set of four plates. Okay, so they're uh, Harry Potter themed plates. They do have individual um, Harry Potter baubles. These are plastic as well, so you know, they're not gonna they're not gonna break, which is great. Um, oh, this is like, it's not plastic. It's very heavy. It almost feels ceramic-ish. Um, there's a cauldron. There's a little Hedwig up here. These have been picked clean. They had Golden Snitch. They had Hermione, Harry Potter. They had the sorting hat. They had the train. There we go. It was uh, obviously a very popular range. And, oh no. Thank God they're plastic. Oh God, it went under here, guys. Oh no, I feel like a horrible person. Wait, here we go. Gotcha, gotcha. Let's hang it. Let's hang it so it can't fall off again. Um, what was I looking at? Oh, that's right, these. We've got Harry Potter. Oh God, no. There's Disney princess baubles as well, guys. But they're everywhere. They're stockings. Just don't touch anything, Mum. Oh, that one's really cute. Look at this. It's uh, it's Dumbo. All right, they have some really fucking cute ones. Um, look, I'm just gonna hang it up because. No, it's like right here. Someone needs to come and tidy this up. I'm not gonna lie. Oh wait. No, these have just been thrown in there. Mishmashy. Um, they have Winnie the Pooh stockings. Uh, they have frozen baubles. This would be great if your kid is like obsessed with a certain like franchise and you're like, oh, I gotta get them, I gotta get them something to do with that. Um, you can probably find something at Big W. Uh, this is Snow White and the Seven Dwarves Advent Calendar. It contains Christmas baubles. I'm, I'm just gonna say, if I had seen this in November, I would have bought the absolute shit out of this because it's the old school, Snow White and the Seven Dwarves, the cartoon that I grew up with, and I want it. I want it. They're $20, but it's December, and I already have too many advent calendars. This is really cute. It's a table decoration, Winnie the Pooh and Piglet putting a star on the tree. Adorable. Back here, I think this is the last one too. There are some um, Harry Potter bonbons and they have little key rings in them. Very cute. Oh, look at Dobby. Adorable. Oh guys, they just have so much. It's like never ending. They've got, um, oh, what was his name? Thumper. Uh, there's Bambi. We've got, oh, don't ask me to remember her name, but it's from The Nightmare Before Christmas. Uh, that's Snow White, I think. There's some of her dwarves. We've got, um, like, uh, Mandalorian, um, Star Wars stuff. I'm not super familiar with that either. We've got Dumbo. There's Woody, there's Spider-Man. There's heaps of, like, there is so much, guys. There is so, so much. Star Wars molded cookie jar. They have like Christmas crackers and look, even more advent calendars. Like they're, the Big W is like on the theme train with their Christmas. They have a whole aisle of it. 
They've even got May Gibbs. What the hell? This is really adorable. This is some cute shit. Look at this. Anyway, they have a lot of options here, but it is like it's getting cleaned out. And I think people have really enjoyed it because you can see they've just kind of gone mad and people don't put things back. Oh, what are these? These are actually pretty cute. Oh, are they almost weighted? Squishy beanies. Yeah, I can feel the beanies in there. Uh, it's cute. I don't hate it. Do these make noise? Because I want to... No, just says it's glitter free. <laughs> Did they know that I was coming? Um, we've got some plush Santas here and elves. They're pretty cute, actually. They are $10. There's more um, Mandalorian themed things. These are little Christmas plushes. He is wearing a Santa hat. Adorable, sweet. Um, we've got some plush 2022 bears, Christmas 20. 22 so it doesn't say that on his hat there and we have the Grinch does he do anything that is the question I don't think he does I think that's he's just in the box to make him look adorable we do have some plates here they say Merry Christmas they come in different sizes they're plastic so you won't risk breaking them and this is um, a tray for the night before Santa arrives we do have some bowls as well, which say Merry Christmas. They're a decent size, good for serving salad. And then we have some mini ones, which is great. So in that same sort of color story that we've been seeing along here, but also we have these ones um, with like a gnome Santa, gingerbread, um, actual Santa and a dog, cute. There are some charger plates. They don't have a lot and they've got some placemats as well. Um, that's very, uh, gives me Australiana vibes. Um, here we have these ones, which are quite cute. Uh, they also have like tablecloths. So you can see, got the stars. This is, you know, red Christmas, uh, silver with reindeers and they've got this one, which is, uh, it's got bells and a poinsettia on it. There's a handbag. Everyone loves a handbag. And we do have some embroidered tea towels as well. Something else that I found in our um, stuff we must have purchased at the end of like, you know, after Christmas last year during the sales uh, was a whole bunch of really beautiful hand towels and they, have a different design to this but they feel like this so i reckon that's where we got them oh my god look what mum found their little cupcake um patty cakes is that cupcake holders they're called apparently beautiful little patterns and they're cute too if you like something a bit less traditional they do have some like glasses and bits and bobs little bit messy but I'll try and show you we have some um, disposable bowls if you feel like that's your vibe this Christmas I never ever ever judge anyone for having paper plates or bowls at Christmas because hosting can be hard they also have these napkins to match which are very very cute um, these are dipping bowls and tray set so you get a tray and the dipping bowls it's difficult to show you what they are, but you can probably tell this is Santa. This is a snowman. This might be an elf, I think. What? Oh gosh. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, get out. That's clever. It's the last one. Okay, so it is a Wiltshire rolling pin with like Christmas designs on it. It's $18. I want it. It's etched in. Too. It is. It's etched in. So as you like roll pastry, it's going to leave like little Christmas trees and, and stars, stars and snowflakes. Yeah. That is Beautiful. really a cool idea. If you yeah. were doing like a Christmas pie yeah. or something, that would be so good on top. Yeah. Beautiful. Hold on to that. I might buy it. Yeah. It's the last one. It's it's risky putting it back, very risky. Um, they do have some vases here, 
which they're actually really nice. They are glass. They've got, you know, some sort of some with fake plants in them. Um, they, these are nice too, actually. Christmas tree, glass Christmas tree. It's red. They have a mug. Um, they have some Christmas inspired uh, essential oils. And back here, this is adorable. It is a Santa lotion dispenser. So you could use that in the bathroom for hand soap or whatever. Uh, yeah, mum was just pointing to these glasses. They, it's a four piece luster wine glass. They do look really pretty. You guys can see they're iridescent. Um, there's something here that I wanted to point out. These are, whoa, they weigh a ton. So there's that. Um, it's cookie icing. So that could make your life a lot easier if you wanted to have like a, a cookie decorating day with the kiddos. They also have a, um, like a cookie decorating kit. So it's got a tree and a gingerbread man shape. And then they've got a cupcake baking kit. Let's pull this down and show you because uh, you need a close up of this. They're little gingerbread sprinkles. How adorable. We are in the way again. We're always in the way when we do this. Uh, that's cute. Very, very cute. It's only $13. It's, it's not, not a bad price. Oh no, I am being that horrible person. Don't break anything. You break it, you buy it. That's a rule. Um, okay, more May Gibbs uh, platters. So they have a rectangular one and a round one. Uh, you'll be able to see it up there. Are they, are those Dishmatics Christmas no, themed? No. <laughs> no, they're not. Um, these are treat bags. Okay, let's, with tags. Oh, I see. Okay, so they're just like white bags with the little gift tags. That's cute. Um, they have some, that's a napkin, metallic sparkle napkin, two pack. Pretty big, but all right. We have a uh, cheese and it's like a cheese platter knife set in the shape of a Christmas tree. Um, this is adorable. Okay, we've got some cookie cutters. Very handy. Everyone loves a good cookie cutter. This is the best thing ever. Yeah. Okay, I don't know if you guys can we. It's a sleigh, but it's a cheese board. It's twenty dollars. I love it. Do we want to buy it? No. Oh. I hate it when she says no. Well, I'd say yes, <laughs> but oh, we've got two, haven't we? Yeah, we do. I do love it. I love that too. That's really nice. And I mean, you can use that all year round. Yeah. It is a paddle serving board. Yeah. Um, it's really the stuff like this. Finding serving boards that aren't boring can be difficult uh this one is 29 dollars. it is quite long though so yeah cold meats cheese platter whatever you wanted we've got some ceramic cheese knives here we've got i feel like it should be like santa claus and mrs claus but it's all these gnome claws stuff I'm, I, don't, I don't get it i don't really get it the gnomes i'm, I'm not I'm not into it um we do have some mugs. Here's one where you can see Santa's face. That's cute. Um, and then there's, you know, Santa's belly. Uh, what's this one? Who's that? It's upside down, isn't it? Is it? I don't know. I'm a bit confused. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, there's a ceramic treat plate back there. It's, you know, Santa gnome vibes. We do have these plastic tumblers as well. There are some uh, mini trifle bowls, could be handy. And then there's a nice big one, $16.80. It's on sale at the moment, which is great. Uh, what else have we got? Wow, okay. May Gibbs, very popular, it appears. These are salad servers, it's a set of two. So it's the big spoon and fork, that's cute. Um, wow, okay. This is, um, it's like a champagne bowl. So you put ice in it and then you can put some uh, bottles of champagne or whatever you want in there. Um, although you could also use that as a mixing bowl if you wanted. It's $24 and it's huge. Um, we have some more paper plates and bowls. They have joy on them. There is some matching napkin as well if you want it. Down here, I wanna show you these. Um, 
they're ombre cocktail glasses so it's a six pack and if we can get just in here you might be able to see they're quite a nice color it's hard for me to show you the aisles here are um pretty skinny and i really don't want to bump into people i feel like i'm being so rude they also have these absolutely gorgeous um oh it's a drink dispenser really oh it is too okay so you can serve punch from it yeah i feel like it's strange with no lid anyway they're 34 dollars. there is also a cake plate um we also have these which are quite nice these are ceramic plates so it says gather which is kind of kind of nice um and if you want some more interesting ones we have these which are like iridescent yeah kind of pretty um so they've got a large plate a side plate and a bowl nice okay um tea lights are these oh, stop it they're gingerbread scented yes they are wow what are these christmas berry oh gingerbread's better but that's cute it's a six pack they're seven dollars gingerbread is obviously popular as you can tell does this smell this is bread berries as well oh that actually smells quite nice not bad um i don't what is this it's a candle oh oh yum i don't know what that's meant to be but it smells fresh and fruity and nice uh also he's cute as a button 16 dollars though big w is kind of i feel like big w is uh up and down with their prices um they also have these so they're candle holders as far as i'm aware um yes they are there you go all right i was thinking you could you also put the fat ones on top. yeah or you could put the skinny ones inside yeah and some of them are on sale so there we go okay let's find another section all right it's a very small christmas section here but that's okay we'll take a look at what they have um these are like disney Oh, look, I'm not gonna lie. To... Yeah, I would. Uh, I'm gonna show them that too. Um, these are kind of cute. I love like an ornament earring, um, but they're Disney themed, so you're gonna have to be into Disney. They also have like um, scrunchies and stuff like that. This is an eye mask, a Santa eye mask. This we want. We want this. We won't take it home it's uh letters for santa and it is as far as i'm aware that is going to be functional i can't i'm scared to open it because one i'm scared to break it two i'm scared to break a nail okay oh people have been chucking stuff in there <laughs> i love it i wonder if they genuinely sell them does it have a price tag it has a barcode and it's glitter free so we approve do we want to find out how much it is? Yeah, okay. All right. While mum does that, let's have a look at some of their gift wrap. I love this color story. This is gorgeous. Um, so it says, Merry Christmas season's greetings, I think. Yes. Um, really nice trio of colors there. Uh, it's a three pack. Each roll is three meters uh by 70 centimeters how much are they five dollars for a three pack uh then we have this uh selection here which is also quite pretty i really like i like the the colors that they've got going on oh this is oh this is cute i feel like this is very um like actual gift from santa ish with like all of the little stamps and stuff on it it's very very cute potentially great for kids who are like really in a santa phase this is really pretty wrapping paper as well i i like their wrapping paper this year it's nice we have some um i don't know what you would really call this theme but it's trees um we've got like silvers and grays okay we got a price on the 
on this guy. It's on sale. It's sixty nine ninety nine, and it was ninety nine ninety nine. Yes. Is that correct? Yeah. Yes. We might we might buy it. <laughs> we might buy it. Um. Anyway, nice nice wrapping paper. Down here we have some very colourful ones. If that's a bit more of your style. Um, and then we have individual rolls. So how much are these individual rolls going for? Maybe $2 maybe? <laughs> yeah, I think these are $2 each. They're glitter free guys. <laughs> I love that they have to uh, be very clear. It's glitter free. Um, so these are two meters by 70 centimeters. We've even got um, some franchise uh, themed ones. So that one is Wonder Woman and we have a batman one but there was also like avengers star wars so lots of options so last year i desperately desperately needed itty bitty little gift bags tiny ones just like you know small i couldn't find them anywhere and it was actually big w that came through for me um and they have them again this year as you can see and they're actually like they're nice quality mine have you know gone through to two christmases now this is their second christmas um but they're nice little bags they're good quality uh they also have packs like this and i picked up one of these packs last year it was just a different style um what is that you've got christmas ribbon They've got some really nice little styles there. They've got traditional red. Um, and this one is, is that slightly iridescent on the edge? It is. That's pretty. They're $3 each. I've got some. <laughs> These are cute. These are actually wood. Yeah, they are. Um, but they're like flamingo and beach themed. Is this tape or ribbon? It's a ribbon roll. Okay cute really nice fun colors there um i really like that every retailer that we've gone to like kmart big w and target they've all got different vibes going on it's beautiful isn't it like i'm kind of loving this bright oh no that was my fault um i'm loving this sort of bright no that just doesn't want to stay up there please stay don't touch it. Don't even look at it. It's upset with us. Um, yeah, I'm loving this like bright theme kind of thing that they've got going on. That's fun. Not everyone likes the traditional stuff. I mean, you got to cater to everyone, don't you? Or you got to cater to different types. Um, I love this theme. This is really beautiful. These little gift tags are stunning. Bows are stunning. The um, wine bags, nice. This gift bag is very pretty. That's actually a three-dimensional tree on it. Um, is there one on the back as well? No, it's flat on the back, but that's okay. That's all right, it's only $3. They have um, <laughs> one with the ornament that looks like the moon. That's beautiful. Um, and then they have like little present toppers and bits and bobs they've got this really nice coral vibe going on i love the coral coral is stunning i will also point out they have the tiny little cards they've got um christmas themed tissue paper um and this one's a red metallic which is cool oh they they did have it in silver as well but oh yeah 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 there's a couple still in there um stocks are low am i surprised no because it's december it's early december but you know it is what it is this bag's really cute too oh is that that's harry mm. potter themed mm. it is no. that's a harry potter themed gift bag which is very cute um letters to santa kit there's a countdown door hanger what is this christmas tree lamp create your own shining tree lamp Oh, it's a little DIY kit for the kiddo. Oh, that's cute. I like it. You guys know how much I'm loving the DIY stuff. 
We do have some reindeers up here, which mum just pointed out. We have some giant felt sacks. Mum's like, oh no. Oh, are they tiny little baubles? Yeah. Oh, you cutie patootie. Look at that green, guys. You know it's speaking to me. I don't know where it goes. It fell off here. It is a bit of a mess. <laughs> Oh my god, is he gonna walk? Yes, he is. <laughs> That's so cute. Now we have to turn him off. He's gonna walk off the shelf. That's enough. Sit. Good boy. Um, so we've got some felt sacks. This one says Merry Christmas and has a reindeer on it. This one has a sleigh. And then we have a Santa character sack. There are um, some stockings. We do have some hats, I will say. And don't think this is mean of me. Actually, no, I found one that's cool. Um, I was going to say Target and Kmart had a better selection of hats. But they sure as hell don't have this. This is awesome. And I love it. That's fantastic. Oh, they're saying it's a tree topper. No, it's fine. If you have a small head, it's fine. It's fine. Get it as a hat. It's awesome. Um, more stockings which is fun. Oh, bonbons. We are we are still looking for the red plastic heart. I don't I don't think they I don't think they're going to have it. No, they all have the same thing in them. Uh, so we have some very traditional old school um, bonbons, which is very cute. I I adore these. That's so sweet. We have some palm trees because why not? These are like, oh, how nice are these? That's beautiful. So it's uh, Santa on his sleigh in a snowy scene. Um, colorful and bright, if that's what you're going for. They have these um, Australian native bonbons. We're seeing different shaped bonbons a lot um, year after year, which is kind of cool. I like that. They do contain the same things that... Um, the traditional ones do wow they are beautiful as well mm. oh you know i don't think i'm ever going to get another one of those red hearts because they're all doing the um the plastic free thing it's uh, look i agree i think oh my god my Daddy, mother hold her. <laughs> <laughs> let me help her Okay, mum's saying I missed this and I've got to show you. It's a wall hanging thing. Santa, tinsel Santa. Um, yeah, I, I think it's great that they're not putting plastic stuff in. Oh, that's origami. I love that. That's fantastic. Um, I think it's great that they're not putting plastic stuff in Christmas crackers. But... I am also sad because I was going to try and find a replacement. Like one of those... If you know, you know. Um, it's like a tacky plastic red heart that was in a uh, Woolies bonbon from years ago when my dad passed away. Um, anyway, chocolates. We got so many chocolates and cookies and Ferrero Rocher. These are my favourite. What are your favourite? Tell me. I want to know. I don't think I've ever had these ones, the dark ones. What are they? Are they just dark chocolate? I have questions. Um, what did I see? Oh, I saw this and I was like, I want to eat it. It's a sh Holy moly, that is heavy. Uh, yeah, there's no price, but it's a lot of cookie. Um, scorched almonds, peppermint cream crunch, caramels, fruit and nut. I want to eat them. It's very heavy. Um, Mum was just saying this giant tin of cookies oh i can't even pick it up yeah. can you flip it help me are they danish butter cookies yeah oh my god buy it for me now i love danish butter cookies yeah. um if you're danish or you have like you know spent some some time over in that part of the world are these like genuine or do we are they 
like do we just call them Danish like yeah are they tricking us or is this like do you guys get to have that stuff all year round because we only get it at Christmas and I'm jealous if you get to enjoy that uh, forever okay um what do we got here we have a jingle bell bracelet we have more like hair scrunchies and hair ties and clips and bits and bobs oh okay this is a color wheel metal dome tree that lights up does it spin color wheel oh no color wheel as in color wheel i, got, I gotcha i gotcha there is a santa here as well which is fairly cute um and we have some hampers so I won't go too deep into this, but they have like different sizes and they vary in their prices. They have little wooden trees with seashells on them. These seashells aren't real seashells. I'll just point that out. Um, so that is cute. It's a table topper. They also have a white tree, if you like a white tree. And they have this one, which is black and flocked on the tips. This is the first black tree that I've seen this season. Uh, it's certainly the first that I've seen in store. Um, maybe ever. I don't think I've ever seen a black Christmas tree in a store before. Um, definitely seen them online. Maybe they had this last year, I'm, I'm not sure. Big W shoppers, feel free to like chime in with your knowledge here. But it looks like the black trees are all gone. Oh my god. Should I be surprised? No, I don't think so. That's a black tree, Mum. Yeah. It's, black. it's actually black. It is. It is. From afar, Ooh. it almost looks like a dark green. Yeah. But no, it's black. Guys, 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 yeah. guys. I want this. I want this. It's Santa's stash. Look at what's inside. I think I think that's I think that's all right. I would be quite happy yeah, to good. find that under the tree. Um, it's $15 and it's on sale. So that's not bad. Um, it's a cool alternative to a like chocolate stocking, but also really festive and fun. Could you imagine being a kid and cracking into that on Christmas day? Good fun. All right, let's just see what other snacks and treats they have. Lots of stockings. I want to eat these. They're like delicious. The pizzas are also great. The hot dogs are probably the best. Or maybe the burgers are the best. I don't know. They're all pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Um, we've got Skittles and M&Ms down here. What is that? Oh, that is just a bag full of sugary, junky noms. I wouldn't say no. I, I just wouldn't. Um, oh, what? 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 Does it squirt candy or does it squirt water? It squirts water. It's a Dino attack water squirt with candy. Uh, pull trigger. Oh, and it sprays out his nose right there. Gotcha. There's also a shark version uh, and there's a green dinosaur as well. Uh, we do have these nice big uh, Santa's boots, which are filled with a party mix. They're fairly cute. We've got uh, ceramic jars, both filled with uh, lollies as well. There's a gingerbread house and... Oh. <laughs> Mum has discovered you can also bite people with that. She just came up and bit me on the shoulder with it. Yep, that's about right. Oh, are these Christmas flavours? <gasps> oh. I don't think they are. I think they're just themed around Christmas. Uh, Jelly Belly Christmas mix. Very cute. Wait, wait, are these, oh my God, are they Christmas themed? Oh, I was kind of hoping that the Jelly Bellies would have these like printed on them. Uh, wishful thinking. It's just Jelly Bellies. Oh, I'm crying, my soul, my soul is crying. Uh, they do have Kinder Surprise Maxis, which are always fun. And these are Christmas themed. I wonder if the toy inside are uh, Christmas themed. I would mighty well hope so. Uh, what else? These are really cute for hanging on the tree. 
Everyone loves Kinder Chocolate. I don't think I know a single person who doesn't like Kinder Chocolate, but also don't be afraid to tell me that you don't like Kinder Chocolate because we all like different things. Um, I don't know what this is, but I want it. I can see like a, a Kinder Country in there and I want to eat that thing. Also, what's that ball? Oh, it's a Kinder Egg, of course it is. Yum, just yum. Uh, that is $10. Listen, Kinder Chocolate, it's expensive. It is what it is. What are these? Salted toffee baubles. Do they have strings for hanging on the tree? No, they don't, but I still want them. <laughs> Yum. Uh, so we've got little caramel style baubles. There is chocolate, um, like milk chocolate. Am I even showing you the camera? It's not even a camera, guys, it's my phone. It gets heavy after I've been holding it for a while and I I notice that it's hard to hold it up. Um, we have, what is this? It's heavy, that's what it is. Santa's variety mix. So there is a variety of Nomi Nomi uh, Cadbury chocolates. Santa's stash, I still want it. What's mum got in her hands? Oh. Oh, I don't know how to say that word, but I've heard of it before. It sounds... Uh, oh, it's soft gingerbread covered with milk chocolate. Yummy. Six bucks. Do you want to get some? I don't know. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. We bought some. What on earth is everybody doing? What are you guys doing? I cannot believe that nobody, like, nobody has cracked into these and been like, hell yeah, I want Warhead strawberry flavoured candy canes. What's going on? 12 sour candy canes. Every single one, untouched. Untouched. I'm, I'm shocked. I see people destroying the shelves everywhere and you won't, you won't take the Warhead sour candy canes. Okay, these are mug topper cookies. Oh yeah, here we go. Mum's got one here. Um, so they're cookies that have little slits in them so you can pop them over your mug for your Christmas drinks. Very cute, $4 a pack. We have some Cadbury Dream White Christmas. So it's creamy. Oh, we've eaten that. Have we? Yeah. White chocolate with raspberry flavored jelly Taste pieces nice. and yeah. almond pieces. Oh, Rice Krispies and almond pieces. It does sound good actually. Um, there's a hot chocolate bar for two. So you get two of the bare marshmallows, two of the chocolate sticks and two uh, peppermint sticks. That's kind of cool. No <gasps> oh, that's fun. I like that. So, yeah, can you reach it? Oh, <laughs> that's why there's a sign that says if you require assistance, ask. So, you get um, microwave popcorn and two popcorn two plastic, plastic tubs, so they're Big reusable. Break. Fantails, because it's not a movie night in without fantails. And you get cinnamon sugar and barbecue seasoning for the popcorn. Yeah. I love that. That's awesome. Can we get it back up there? Yeah, we're all good. Milk chocolate letters. C for something. Um, the letters are there. There's no H. So we move on. What the hell? Is that a giant Ferrero Rocher? <laughs> oh my God, it actually is. Oh my God. It pays to You'd look, guys. To I would be sick this after that. Is that really a giant? It this is. One oh, I think that should be fine is that a big one in yeah. a box? No, no, you can see it's got a little, it's got the little, I've never seen a giant a giant Ferrero Rocher in my life. Uh, it is hollow though. So think of it kind of like oh, an Easter right. Yeah, They're think right. of it kind of like an Easter egg. But that is very festive. I I love it. Oh yeah, $23 for those big tins. That's not too bad. What is that? Is so, it yeah. a barbecue? No. no, it's not. They're no, biscuits. No, it's, it's not. not. It's biscuits. <laughs> oh that's funny that is funny um okay shortbread uh danish butter cookies belgian chocolates um oh yeah 20 bucks i want it oh this is pretty too what's in here 
uh, turn the top clockwise to play music. We're not going to boom make a music. Cookies. We got cookies in a really pretty jar. These are nice bottles. Mm. Um, you've got chili infused sunflower oil, balsamic vinegar, and peppercorn and spices infused olive oil. Oh. And there's more hampers. Oh, whip. Oh, interesting. Look at this Dalgona whipped coffee set. So you get a little whisk, you get a nice glass jar, um, and then you get the bits for making a Dalgona coffee, which is interesting they have capitalized on that popularity uh, but it's like two years too late maybe there are a bunch more like bags and you know present toppers we have more wrapping paper is that where it ends okay all right um bits uh wrap and bow storage bags we like them believe the magic of christmas yes it's a very special time. Yeah. It's a giant bonbon. Suitable for eight people, it says. Wow. Yeah, okay. wow, indeed. Okay, let's have a look. So, um, oh, it's a game. It contains eight party hats, eight jokes, and find the pairs game. Oh, okay, okay, okay. It doesn't contain the plastic heart, though. Otherwise, I would buy it. That's cool. I don't hate it. They have the gnome Santa and they have a um, uh, nutcracker. I'm trying to put this box back. So yeah. Oh, no. oh gosh. Um, heaps of cards. Some really nice designs in there as well. There's someone coming, so I'm going to get out of the way. Okay, look, guys. Christmas, Christmas clothes. The shirt. It's the shirt. The shirt is so cool. And that is okay so we've got flamingos with candy canes and lollies on them um and this is i love this this is so cool um it's mostly like it's got that sort of australiana feel with the flowers and stuff but it's got candy canes on it cute as a button but come around here yeah mum's like come and look come and look this one is cute too it's a um t-shirt with uh trees on it we've got feeling festive down here and team santa this uh, this would be me oh and it's quite soft too it's mm. not bad um okay bluey themed pajamas but what's cool about it is it's like it's a family set yeah. so you've got ones for the little ones you've got some for mum and you've got some for dad listen I am going to be that type of parent. I, I am. I've discussed it with my partner and he's okay with it. So we're all good. And one for Nana. And one for Nana. Yeah, <laughs> Nan, Nana wants one too. They do have uh, Disney ones as well. And look, plus size, which is great because, you know, include, let's be inclusive for everyone. Um, that's really pretty. I love this. This is very australiana and you might be like is that even christmas if you look closely the koalas are wearing um christmas hats and the uh kangaroos have bows on them which okay the bows maybe not so christmasy but like there's uh baubles this is a parrot holding a bauble it's actually really cute i like it we are seeing more like disney themed christmas stuff Oh, this is cute. Up to Snow Good. Uh, it's Star Wars themed, and he, it's a Star Trooper making a, a snow angel, which is pretty cute. Um, I've got that dress again. I think over here we've got more Disney stuff. Let's have a look. What's this? Oh, that's Friends themed. Uh, the one where it's Christmas. That's cute. What's here? Oh yeah, Goofy and Mickey and Donald Duck. That's cute. Okay, excellent. What's on the red one? Let's have a look. Oh, there we go. Merry and bright. We do see a lot of these like, um, you know, alcohol inspired gift sets. I'm not going to go through them all, but just know that Big W do have some. Um, they look to be like three packs of uh, cocktail mixes. They have these. They're like little balls that you add to your um like sparkling wine or your champagne and they're edible so there's lemon strawberry and peach flavor 
kind of fun there's also a milkshake kit down here um to make like a you know fully loaded milkshake you can see there are more like you know family um pajama sets here super cute <laughs> this is cute i like it santa on a surfboard and we've got some grinch themed ones as well feeling grinchy uh that's kind of cute i don't hate it it's i like the color um what on earth is this really it's official licensed product from volkswagen um and it's that it's santa with a reindeer in there that's cool mum check this one out uh then we have more grinch themed pajamas these ones i really like because they come with a stocking for the kids i think that's a good idea they have i like it too they have a red one um and a blue one for uh the little boys or you know if they want to wear red or blue whatever who cares um but they both come with stockings which is fantastic there are some like activity sets if anyone from big w ever watches this um i don't know if you already do this maybe i'll come across it later but make some for adults make adult Christmas themed activity stuff. We love it too. Um, so there is a six pack of uh, Christmas storybooks. There's gem art cards. This here is a make your own stocking with everything you need. And then there's the scratch off art ornaments. Fun, I don't hate it. Um, this looks to be like a mega, yeah, it's a bulk craft kit. So you can see all the goodies in there to keep your kids busy there's an activity book with pens and if we look here what do we have these are okay christmas foam stickers but you can see them mostly on this side they're pretty cute i like the style oh my god look at these so cute oh my god i've got a dog let's let's do this no she won't fit any of this um that's adorable the pet band bandana is also very, very cute. And then they have more like, um, you know, kids pajama sets, but apparently they are family sets. So maybe, uh, you, oh yeah, I can see some over here. Oh, this is all Christmas as well. There we go. I'm just gonna give you guys like a little overview. I, <laughs> this is so cute. Um, I oh, stop it. Look at this one. That's adorable. That's oh, for the baby. Um, I think they've got a really good range. I have shown you guys the uh, pajama ranges at Kmart and Target, and they don't have nearly as much as this. These are board shorts, um, which you can see they're festive themed. We've got different types of. I don't know if they're festive shirts, but look, we've got, you know, we've got stuff going on here at Big W. So uh, Big W is definitely on my radar with Christmas stuff now, even more so than they already were. I didn't know they had such a, a huge, Merry Mama, Merry, <laughs> okay, I get it now. I get it, Merry Mama, Merry Minnie. Um, yeah, I, I think they have a great selection, especially like the clothing. Yeah. Um, which is fun because sometimes yeah. you're just the happiest season. It is. It's cute. I feel like we saw them before. Maybe we did. There is more here at Big W though. I do want to let you guys know they actually have quite a big range. It is scattered throughout the shop. I don't go through and look at everything because it would just take too long. Mum's trying to buy a kitten tin. Is it cookies? No, it's just... Oh, is it? Okay. There's... The puppies and kittens, they're festive. But like I said, there is a lot more around the store. Look, we have these, which are adorable. These little kinder packs. So I'm gonna leave that there and I will catch you in the next one. Bye.